Good morning and welcome to a whole new day in Stranded Deep. The sun is rising, the things are going weird, and we're on a hunt for some rocks. Now I'm trying to make a bed, uh, but right now I have not been able to find any rocks, and apparently I need rocks to build a bed, so... Um, well, just to let you know the situation, our fire pit has run out uh, from the last episode. Um, and we, I've put some stuff over there and all my stuff that I found on that ship has been stored over here. So now, we are looking for a fire pit. Uh, we're looking for some rocks. Why did I say fire pit? I'm so sorry. Uh, because there's some potatoes I've found. Um, because it is very important uh, for us to build our uh, bed uh, so we can sleep through the night. And we have ourselves another shipwreck right over there. So we will keep that in mind. But first of all, let's pop over to this small island and see what's over there. Ooh, starfish. All right, let's go. Now on this small island, we have a stick. And that's pretty much it. I was really hoping for some stone. Um, oh, what's this? Whoa. I shouldn't really be here. Let's get the hell out of here. Something was over there that I could pick. Oh, I think those were just fishes. Just gonna check out this area. Be very careful of sharks, because I think they do kill. Right, let's just get back down there, because that is very cool. Just want to see what's down here, really. I'm curious. A very beautiful game, I'll tell you that. Alright, nothing. Okay, so, let's get back in there. Uh, we cannot raft over to other islands just yet. I think we will need to get a lot more stuff before we do that. There's a lot of debris in the water. Maybe that doesn't mean anything, but I'm new to the game, so I will explore. Now, stone. Uh, why do we need stone? Because I think you need stone to build a bed. And at the moment, there is no stone around the island. So I'm not going to spend too long looking for it. Actually, what we're going to do is check out the second shipwreck, which I've just found. But I'm just going to take a few minutes to attempt to find some stone. Uh, playing in HD, it shouldn't be so hard. I mean, well, rock, not stone, some rocks. And we're going to have to get as many of these yucca plants as grow, you know, to pick up as much lashing. And this is actually where I'm dropping all my bits and bobs. Oh, that's my axe. Uh, right now, I can build a foundation. I actually don't know how to bring up the crafting menu just here properly. So I'm using every mouse button because I know it does work eventually. Oh, that's not how you do it. You have to bring up the hammer and I believe you have to left click. It tells us that it's available. There we go. We can build a foundation, which means we can build either a normal foundation or a raft. A raft, whatever you like to call it. But we don't want that. We actually want to build a bed. So there we go. We have ourselves one rock. We need more than that, I believe. We need rocks for bed, which is quite weird. But actually, we're going to go ahead and find out where that boat was, which was... Somewhere around here when we were... Yeah, it was here. Just gonna go check out the area and see if we can't see that ship again. There we go, there it is. Alright, so it's just over there. We're gonna grab our raft, a raft even. Oh my god, I can't speak. And we're gonna go straight in for that. Uh, go and grab that. What we need to do is drop our stuff off where our loot is. Which is over here. The stuff doesn't seem to disappear, which is very good. We do not need a lighter. We're going to keep our knife in case, we do not need our hammer, we do not need our axe, which is actually damaged. We do have our pocket knife, which is great. That looks like a cockpit of a plane, that's cool. Actually, what am I doing? Sorry, I forgot my uh, paddle. Um, I think our life raft can die, it has died on me before, so if it does, we're going to have to build a new one, which I know how to, which is quite useful. But the raft is empty so it shouldn't work, because last time our raft was full and it wasn't moving at all. So we're going to go ahead and raft our way over. Now the reason I'm rafting is because I think sharks kill, but from what I've heard is sharks don't, can't kill. I'm not sure just yet. But actually what I want to show you guys is this. There you go, this shows you your water, your food and your health level, and the time and everything else, how many days you've survived and everything else. Very good. If you press and hold F and then right click it will show you your vitals, which is what I need. Right, so this ship was just in that direction, so let's just get out of that. Ah, I see it from here. 
From what I've heard, sharks can't actually kill you. They can attack you, but they can't drain your health. Unless that's been crashed, uh, that would be quite nice. But actually, I cannot make it over to the next island, which is quite, quite discouraging. Um, the reason for that is, is the raft last time it died on me, it just disappeared from under my feet. I think it's because the shark was attacking me, because I was being circled by a shark, it's very possible. But here we have our wreck, and we do have something here. Goggles. Alright, very good. Is that it? Can't be. Can't be it. Better than oh, I hit shit, 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 shit. <sighs> okay, we're getting the fuck out before he eats my wrath like before, and then I'm gonna be messed up. Go, 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 go! Don't eat my wrath! Don't eat my wrath! Please don't eat my wrath! Well, we got goggles, which we are wearing, which is nice. Uh, we, can, uh, we can breathe under the water better. Alright, let's leave that here. Screw you, shark, you scared the crap out of me. Now, let's have a look around a little bit more. See if there isn't anything around. Not really. I'd like to see the other islands, but I can't make it to them just yet. I mean, I can, if I find a way across, uh, maybe the other raft is a bit more sturdy and maybe I can avoid sharks. Um, it will be much better. Alright, so food is getting low, but that's fine. Just have the lighter here. Look for some more rocks, because I really want to build a bed. I don't want to have to be awake another night. we got yucca plants here, which are... Not fully grown. I think that means they can disappear if we keep taking sh flashing from them, I don't know. Alright. Alright, so our adventure did go well, we did find something. Um, not exactly what I was hoping for, there's a shark. That ship we already checked. Alright. So, I can build a foundation, and I think I will do. Uh, for that I need my hammer. Actually, place that stick over there. I might just build a foundation just to show you what it looks like and how you can place them, etc. Um, we are trying to survive and I think that would be very good for survival and I will build the bed as soon as I find out how to. So we're going to have to grab our hammer. And what we're going to have to do is go over here and click on these and try and get the thing to pop out. Unfortunately, sometimes it takes a while. There we go. Is it the other one? It can't be the middle. It should be the right mouse button. Sometimes it just doesn't work. Um, which is a problem. Oh, there we go. Uh, it clicked here somewhere. Shouldn't be clicking like crazy. Should just be taking my time with it. I think I just have too many buildables there and the game is getting glitched out. Okay, I'm move this slash in, I'm gonna move them about a little bit. Okay. Alright then, give it a minute. <laughs> oh, come on. This is what happens when you don't do your research before playing the game. Oh, so many physics I actually lagged there. This is not very good. Uh, it's getting actually dark, so I want to build this foundation before. Okay, now we are absolutely unable to do anything. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to figure out why that's an issue, and I will probably build that later. Um, because I don't know why it's been uh, like that, unfortunately, because I've, I've not played much. This is a pre-alpha, so the bugs like this are bound to happen. I think I've seen another rock. Very good. They're very hidden around. Oh my, flag. There we go. Foundation. Eight sticks. Alright, so we're going to build a foundation right over here under the trees. 
where we will be able to put our bed later. Poof, very good. Now we can't build anything else because we need more sticks. So what we're going to have to do is get our axe, which I shouldn't be wasting right now. I should just get a crude axe instead, uh, which I will build in the next episode. It's getting dark, so I'm just going to get some more logs to build a campfire and stuff like that, and roof and supports and whatever else for my little hut. I'm going to move them over to the pile. I'm going to have to chop down the tree. It's going to be running low on trees soon. Let's get these hookers. We need strands flashing here. I'm worried that these hookers lands will disappear later because that'll be a killer for me. Alright, let's get this out of the way. Then we've got to be careful and make sure our axe doesn't die on us. Actually, I love this game, just for to point out. It's a very cool game. Uh, but it's just that I don't understand it much at the moment. But I do enjoy playing it. I love it. I'm going to move our log over there, quickly. We have plenty of lashings now, which is good. I was worried about that. Looks like I'll uh, just regenerate. Right, so we need to build our supports. Screwed axe, screwed hammer, we're gonna build one of these later. Oh, bed! There it is! Okay, very good. We have ourselves a bed, guys. We can't build it up on our foundation anyway. Yeah, great. So we're gonna build our bed right in here. There we go! We can sleep and sleep to the, through the night, which is nice. Uh, we have ourselves a bed, we have ourselves a foundation. We're actually going to make... Um, another foundation later uh, which will get us um, another little boat and then we'll try again to get over there well what I'm actually going to have to try and build now if I can, there we go um, we cannot at the moment because we need a stone shard but I wanted to uh, build uh, basically one of those arrow thingies whatever you guys call it to um, to allow us to get, um, to allow us to kill sharks, etc. if they attack us, uh, like a little spear thing. I'm gonna drop all our lashings. We're gonna have a look at how much health I have. Very good, actually, really good. We don't even need to eat a coconut at the moment. Uh, we're gonna make a campfire in the night, but I think right now we're gonna make a crude axe and start chopping down some of these trees and get everything set up for the next day. Get all these lashings out of the way, we have enough now. I know how to do it now, you have to press and hold. Uh, so we're going to make a crude axe. Which is down here somewhere. There it is. The reason I've made this is because I'd rather waste this axe in the beginning and keep my good axe for later, it might be more useful. I don't know. This will take a more while, but it's very cheap to build, and why not? Why use an expensive axe when I can use that later on in life if I survive? God knows how many days we will survive. Can I move this? No, I can't. It's too heavy. So yeah, basically that's how you craft. You press and hold the right uh, button, which took my right mouse button, or left mouse button, anyway, which took me so long to figure out. It's actually disappointing, but it's cool that now I have a bed and you know things are progressing, which is nice. I really like that. Um, and this is going to be where I will build everything. I mean, all the options will pop up if you have the available resources to do so. So that's very nice. Going to go to the break days and keep bringing them over. And the more logs we have, the better because we're going to build a campfire and cook some crab again. I love cooking crab, it's like the best food ever. Remember, don't get food poisoning like I did, that can actually kill you. I am very fortunate not to have died. Remember that. So don't, don't eat uncooked crab, it will kill you. We have plenty of crab, actually, we have plenty of survival uh, bits and bobs here which uh, kind of surprises me like how much we have now built up and we can now make a bigger foundation maybe put something on top put some, you know, have a little house. Um, and later on I'm gonna have to figure out how I can get to another island that's that's really what I want to do I want to explore the waters the deep um, hence the name stranded deep <laughs> there we go we have some palm, palm fonds there we go ourselves a crab for dinner very good 
and here's all our bits. So what we actually have in our inventory right now, we have a lantern which does work if I will show you in the night, it's very good. Uh, for now it works, I don't know what the fuel on it is or anything. We got a fuel tank which is a part of an engine. We have binoculars, torch, lighter, duct tape and a whistle. So all I do is the sun is setting so I'm going to end this episode here and I'll see you guys in the next day. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed, leave a like and comment, you do know this is a starting um, channel so I'm going I'm to need all the support I can have. So guys if you've really enjoyed, all you have to do is leave a like and a comment and I will love you for it. Okay? Um, and of course subscribe for more of these videos. So pretty much that's that's what I'm seeing around us. Now we've got to figure out a way or a strong enough raft or something like that that will get us to the other island. Maybe I might just go on exploration uh, on the next video, which I will build a wooden raft, which I know how to do. It's just a foundation you put on water. And just go. Just go and see if I can avoid the sharks and get to the nearest island, which will probably be this one. So we'll go towards that. All right? See you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.